intersection of cone and cylinder problem 16.22 a vertical cone diameter of base 75 mm and axis 100 mm long is completely penetrated by a cylinder of 45 mm diameter the axis of the cylinder is parallel to the hp and the vp and intersects the axis of the cone at a point 28 mm above the base draw the projections of the solids showing curves of intersection cutting plane method draw lines dividing the surface of the cylinder into 12 equal parts assume a horizontal cutting plane passing through say point 2 the section of the cylinder will be a rectangle of width w while that of the cone will be a circle of diameter EE. These two sections intersect at points P2 and P12. These sections are clearly indicated in the top view by the rectangle 2, 2, 12, 12 and the circle of diameter EE. In the front view, the cutting plane is seen as a line coinciding with 2 dash 2 dash. Points P2 and P12 when projected on line 2 dash 2 dash with which the line 12 dash 12 dash coincides will give a point P dash 2 with which P dash 12 will coincide. Then P-2 and P-12 are the points on the curve of intersection. To obtain the point systematically, draw the circles with center O and diameters DD, EE, FF, etc. cutting the lines through 1, 2 and 12, 3 and 11, etc. at points P1, P2 and P12, P3 and P11, etc. Project these points to the corresponding lines in the front view. Two more key points at which the curve changes directions must also be located. Their positions are determined from the side view. They are the points of nearest approach, that is, M double dash and N double dash, at which the lines drawn from the center of the circle and perpendicular to the extreme generators of the cone cut the circle. Project these points to M dash and N dash in the front view and to M and N in the top view on the corresponding lines. Draw curves through these points in both the views. The back curve in the front view will coincide with the front curve. In the top view, a part of the curve will lie hidden and hence it will be dotted. Draw similar curves on the right hand side of the axis of the cone. 